Hello, in this video, we will discuss about IP address classes. Guys, in the previous video, we have discussed what is an IP address. IP address is a logical address which is assigned to every machine in the network. Now, if you remember, IP address was having four octets. Now, let me tell you a new thing. IP address is actually divided into two parts. Network bits and host bits. Like I have IP address 172.16.122.204. This IP address is divided into two parts. I have 16 network bits and 16 host bits. What do you mean by network bits? Network bits means how many sub networks we can have from this networks. What do you mean by host bits? Host bits means how many host we can have in this particular network. Now the question is how we will get to know how many network bits will be there and how many host bits will be there. Guys, to answer the simple question, we have IP address classes. IP address are divided into five classes, class A, class B, class C, class D and class E. Class A, B and C we used in LAN and WAN networks. LAN stands for local area network, WAN stands for wide area network. Class D is used for multicast. Class E is used by DOD. So, we will concentrate on class A, B and C. The IP addresses which we are going to use in LAN and WAN networks. Now the question is, how we will get to know a IP address belongs to class A, B, C, D or E. So, we are categorizing it on the basis of first octet. Guys, again I am saying, we are categorizing it on the basis of first octet. It means, value in the first octet will tell us whether this IP address belongs to class A, B, C, D or E. Let's say, if value in the first octet is from 0 to 127, it means it belongs to class A. If value in the first octet is from 128 to 191, it means it belongs to class B. If value is from 192 to 223, it means class C. If value is from 224 to 239, it means it is class D. If value is from 240 to 255, it means it is of class C. And we will focus mainly on first three classes, A, B and C. So, here you know how to categorize it. Now you can see IP address and you can tell that this particular IP address belongs to this class. Let me write IP here. 10, 1, 1, 10. It belongs to class A. 192, 1, 1. It belongs to class C. 175, 1, 1, 1. It belongs to class B. So, how I am categorizing it? Value in the first octet is 10. It is in between this range. It is class A. Value in the first octet is 192. It is between this range. So, class C. Value in the first octet is 175, it is in between this range, so class is B. Now, the second concern is how these classes will define how many network bits and how many host bits will be there. Guys, it is actually predefined. How? If I talk about class A, for class A there will be 8 network bits and 24 host bits. If I talk about class B, in class B, 16 network bits, 16 host bits. In class C, there will be 24 network bits and only 8 host bits. Now, let me give you some examples. Let's say I have a IP 10.1.1.100. So, you know this IP belongs to class A. So, this octet, these 8 bits belongs to network and these 24 bits belong to Post. Let's say our IP 
168.10.100. So this is class C. It means first 24 bits belongs to network and last 8 bits, bits belongs to host. If I have a IP 175.100.101.10. So this IP belongs to class B. It means first 16 bits belongs to network and last 16 bits belongs to host. So on the basis of classes, we can easily categorize to which class a particular IP address belongs. So guys, in this video, we have discussed what are IP address classes. Thank you.